this is the Lush Cross um, Lazy Oaf um, collab and I got the Bath Bomb Duo set um, because I like both of these scents and this evening I've decided I'm going to have the sad face because it's bedtime soon I thought this would be perfect because it's twilight scented and um, this is what the box looks like you might have seen my um, opening of it and then I've still got the little intergalactic one in there for another time. This one is twilight scented, so it's got lavender, benzoin resinoid, ylang ylang and tonka. And I never expected to like anything with the lavender in because it normally irritates my throat. But I do like the twilight bath bomb. Um, and you can buy these separately, so you don't have to buy them as a duo. So if you just want to buy one of them, you can buy them for £7 each. So... Um, which I think is a good idea because not everybody's going to like both the scents. This bath bomb is a good size as well, it is quite heavy and I'm just really curious to see what colours it's going to give in the water so I'm just going to pop it in for you now. Quite a fast spinner. The scent that stood out in the box between the two actually was the intergalactic. As soon as I opened the box, then the, the waft of the minty intergalactic scent hit my nose. So for the duo of the bath bombs, it's £14. And yeah, as I said, they're £7 each. You don't pay any extra for the box that they come in, the packaging. See, in my head I expected lilac or purple just because it's twilight scented. So yeah, let me know if you've tried either of these bath bombs. Um, the demo of the intergalactic or happy face one will follow straight after this one. It's quite an active bath bomb and I can see quite a lot of shimmer in, in the water as well floating around. But yeah, look how frothy that is. Okay, so it's been about eight minutes now and it's just literally just coming to an end. Um, so this is the colour of the water as I said, so it's like an emerald green and there is quite a lot of shimmer in there. It does smell lovely in here so I'm really hoping that the scent is quite strong in the bath as well. But I will report back to you. Hi, so I'm out of the bath now and yeah, this is a lovely bath bomb I think. The water, once it's all mixed together, does end up, I don't know if it's showing on camera, it does end up more of a teal green colour, so it's a lovely colour. There's lots and lots of shimmer, so my arms and legs and everything absolutely covered in shimmer, so if you don't like shimmer this probably won't be for you. The scent has lingered on my skin as well, I can smell it already. I really like this bath bomb, um, I was in here for over an hour, I was watching something on my phone, watching a video and yeah, it's just really relaxing, I really like the scent and my boyfriend said, um, he came in and he said he really liked the colour of the water and he liked the scent as well, he said he'd give it 7 out of 10 and then when I told him that it was lavender in there he was actually quite surprised because he's not a big fan of floral scents either. So yeah, I'd really recommend this one and the next one I will be using will be the Happy Face which is intergalactic so watch out for that one next. Hello and so today I'm going to be trying the Happy Face bath bomb and this one is intergalactic scented so it is like a warm minty scent to me so it's got peppermint oil, vetiver or cedarwood oil and there's grapefruit in there as well. But I love this scent, so let's see what this one does. Once again, this one's not hanging around either. Let's see what, I can see some green coming out of it now, so um, let's see if the water's going to be green or something else. Yeah, it's mainly blues and greens coming out. And to be honest with you, this is the sort of colour you would expect with this scent. So the bathroom already smells quite minty. So yeah, loving the scent so far. So it's very similar to the sad face. 
But I like the colours anyway, so I'm quite happy. Okay, so it's finished fizzing now. It's, about, it's going for about six minutes and yeah, the colour of the water is sort of like a, a jade green and there is a lot of shimmer in there. So I will have the bath and I will report back to you. Okay, so I'm out of the bath and yeah, once again, this is a lovely bath bomb as well. So I am covered in glitter again, so there's lots of shimmer in here. So if you don't like shimmer, these bath bombs won't be for you. And the scent has lingered already. I can already smell it on my skin, so it's a nice minty scent. So yeah, I'd highly recommend this gift box. Thinking about getting this one, I'd definitely go for it, and especially if you like twilight and intergalactic scents. So lovely bath bombs and would make a lovely gift as well, I think. So yeah, that's my feedback on them. Let me know if you've tried them and what you think of them as well. And if you like this video, don't forget to press the like button and I will catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.